Yo, what's up, YouTube? Welcome to the Coffee Pod. My name is Shisha Zed. Drink the coffee, it'll make you feel better. Thirsty wife gets exposed for hitting on men, thirst trapping on TikTok. So basically what happened here is a married woman left a thirsty comment underneath some guy's um, TikTok and they exposed her. No more wasting time. Let's get it. There she is. Ah. <laughs> oh man, so I don't know if you guys caught that, but let me just quickly explain what was going on there. Basically what happened was the married woman left a comment um, right underneath the TikTok post there that read, y'all so damn fine be right back getting a divorce with the cute with the face you know the innocent begging emoji she's begging him to bust those cheeks fast not slow with the heart emojis followed right after that right it took one TikTok for this lady to disrespect her husband so after this married woman left the comment he proceeded to screenshot it crop it and then send it as a DM to her husband. And how I'm assuming this happened is her account is linked to her Instagram page and he found her husband and shot her a message that read me personally, I wouldn't let my wife talk like that. Sheesh, I like this coffee. It's not every day you see a man um, using his powers for good. When he really could take your girl, he's exposing your girl to let you know that she belongs to the earth. But as always, man, let's see what the people have to say. Let's check out these comments. This first commenter says, nah, that lady really deleted her account. Yo, with the laughing emojis. Yo, when I first saw this, I was dead. Next commenter says, grow out here ruining marriages. Next comment, nah, she deserved it for talking crazy. With the laughing emojis, bro doing God's work, protecting other kings. Yes, one round of applause for um, this obvious gentleman over here. You know, because some guys, they'll just do the thirst trapping thing. They'll take a girl, they'll fly her out. And then she comes back to you, right? And you think everything's straight, but she's getting her cheeks clapped by niggas on TikTok, right? <laughs> this female commenter says, I didn't see that coming. Laughing my A off. I was dead when I saw it, man. Um, it felt good. It felt good. Female commenter says, damn. I'm sure she's going to, the way she commented, she's going to adjust the way she moves. This is a warning to all you women. Men are done supporting 304s. We're done, man. We've decided to love ourselves. We found a common enemy, modern day uh, female empowerment. <laughs> and we're banding together to, to, to stop the breakdown of families. And, it's, and, it, and it starts here. It starts on TikTok. This female commenter says, I wonder how many relationships have gotten messed up by you. Laughing emojis. I bet this ain't the first and it won't be the last. We're feeding coffee to all these modern women. Drink the coffee, it'll make you feel better. Next comment, please, you should be ashamed. Laughing my effing A off. Her marriage is over, as it should be. As it should be, what a terrible woman. Next comment, her account got deleted. Her husband definitely did something. <laughs> That's funny. I didn't actually, um, I didn't actually double check to see if that's true or not, but I, I bet it is, right? Next, this female commenter says, look what you done started. Yes, I hope this is a trend. I hope this keeps up. Next, I can't believe people will use their connected profiles and comment that stuff for anyone to see. So basically this person is saying, hey, you should have used a fake account. That's what all the married women are doing out here. <laughs> Next comment, laughing emojis. She deleted the comment in her page, damn. She deleted her page too. That's crazy. This commenter goes on to say, I think he effing got on her. So it turns out after all this, the actual married woman actually threatened to either sue him or have him taken to jail for exposing her. Um, he posted something that said, apparently she made a video duetting me saying I will go to jail for sharing her personal info. And why would she say that? Well, because she's mad, right? She's mad that she's being held accountable. She's mad that she has to drink coffee. 
No, um, I'll have a tea, actually. Guys, I thought this story was hilarious. As always, curious to know what you guys think. Leave your comments down below. Do you think this guy actually did anything? Do you think he actually got her account taken? Maybe he didn't even see the video, right? But chances are, from the way it looks like, um, all her accounts are missing, her threatening him. This could have been really detrimental for that man's marriage. No woman who's married should be out here underneath men's posts. Listen, we know if you're in a relationship, you're going to see other people who you find attractive. It's natural, right? But to go as far as like leaving thirsty comments like this, you're disrespecting your man. And for all these women who think this is okay, because this is like modern women today, they think this stuff is cool. Well, I don't actually know him. Nah, these guys will fly your girl out, bro. Fast, not slow, right? They will fire out and they will bust those cheeks. Keep playing with fire. You'd be surprised what goes on out here. You'd be surprised the type of DMs and stories that I hear. And I'm not talking about guys who just got a little following on TikTok. I'm talking about celebrities who go and fly out. Just basic, average, everyday, day-to-day -day women. It's crazy out here. Listen, guys, as always, leave your comments down below. Let me know what you guys thought of the content of the topic. I appreciate you for checking out another episode of the coffee pod man till next time i'm out peace when i look back at my life tracing back to middle school high school the truth is man i was never that guy that women found attractive in fact i remember vividly women approaching me and telling me things like hey i just want you to know that your friend is cute could you tell them that right or they'll say like my friend likes your friend and could you tell him that my friend thinks he's cute? Maybe, you know, he could talk to her. And going through this a bunch of times while I was young and really didn't understand why women didn't find me attractive, it lowered my self-esteem. In this lesson, I'm going to show you how to successfully shoot your shot and message women online. I'm going to show you how to create a connection between you and the woman that you match with and then how to raise her attraction and finally, set a date. This will blow your mind.